Master number 11, Life Path. In the vast, complex landscape of numerology, Master number 11 stands tall, shimmering with mystery and ancient wisdom. Historically, numbers have always held potent significance across various cultures. They've been intertwined with our spiritual essence, guiding our path and mirroring cosmic rhythms. And among these numbers, 11, with its enigmatic pull, is akin to a hidden gem waiting to be unearthed. Diving into the depths of ancient Egyptian civilization, we find clues to the reverence surrounding this number. The land of the pharaohs, with its pyramids pointing skywards, might have held 11 as a symbol of ascension, an emblem of the earthly striving towards the divine. This isn't just limited to Egypt. In the East, where spiritual concepts and daily life were often inseparable, numerology formed the very fabric of their understanding of the universe. 11 could have represented duality, the yin and yang, light and shadow, creation and destruction, reminding us of the delicate balance that sustains life. Pythagoras, often hailed as the father of numerology in the Western world, was no mere mathematician. He was a philosopher, a seeker, a wanderer. His travels took him across ancient lands, absorbing wisdom from the old world's greatest civilizations. His encounters with Egyptian priests, Babylonian scholars, and the wise men of the East undoubtedly enriched his perspective. So, when we speak of the master number 11, we're not just referencing a digit, we're delving into a treasure trove of knowledge that transcends boundaries. With his harmonic theories and mathematical symphonies, Pythagoras would have grasped the profound nature of 11. He might have seen duality and unity coexisting in its two parallel lines, a dance of numbers where each entity supports and complements the other. Yet what makes 11 even more intriguing is its inherent duality. Just as it hints at deep spiritual insight and enlightenment, it also emphasizes the importance of grounding. Those influenced by this number often oscillate between intense bouts of intuition, sometimes bordering on the psychic, and the need to remain connected to reality. It's as if the number beckons one towards a higher realm, yet it also serves as a reminder that our earthly existence, with its tangible realities, is equally significant. In essence, the master number 11 serves as a bridge, a bridge between the old and the new, the known and the unknown, the material and the spiritual. It's a reminder that we should be wary of losing touch with the reality that grounds us in our quest for spiritual growth. This intricate dance, this balance of energies, makes 11 not just a number but a journey of discovery, introspection, and evolution. In numerology, understanding the vibrational essence of numbers is akin to deciphering an ancient cosmic language. When one moves into the realm of master numbers, the stakes are higher, the energies more potent. The master number 11, in particular, often finds itself inextricably linked with spiritual awakening and enlightenment. Its resonance is powerful, echoing with an almost ethereal quality, making it a favorite among spiritual seekers and mystics. The biblical numerology has profound references to the number 11, marking it as one of consequence. Judas Iscariot, the 11th disciple, was the catalyst for a chain of events that led to the crucifixion and subsequent resurrection of Jesus Christ. This positions 11 as a symbol of dissonance, but also redemption. The duality it represents, of destruction and rebirth, offers an intriguing dimension to its already multifaceted nature. By the way, that reminds me. If you want a personalized reading of your master, name, and birth numbers, click the link in the video description now. It's free. Back to the video. Stepping into the Eastern philosophies, where the cosmic dance of numbers finds a different rhythm, 11 is perceived through a unique lens. The Taoist philosophy, emphasizing balance and harmony, may regard 11 as representing the harmonious integration of opposites. It represents simultaneous existence, the ebb and flow, the eternal cycle of creation and dissolution. With its two halves, the yin-yang symbol visually represents this duality and could very well embody the energies of 11, two entities, side by side, distinct yet one. Navigating the path of master number 11 is akin to walking on a razor's edge. On the one hand, there's the promise of spiritual insight, the allure of psychic experiences, and the gift of heightened intuition. On the other, 
there's the challenge of using these gifts responsibly. Those under its influence often report a heightened sense of empathy, an ability to tune into the emotional and psychic currents around them. But this sensitivity, if unchecked, can also lead to emotional turmoil, making grounding practices essential for those resonating with this number. The underlying theme we consistently encounter with the number 11 is its call for balance. Whether it's the integration of spiritual insights into daily life, the harmonious existence of opposites, or the equilibrium between intuition and reason, it's a number that constantly nudges one towards finding their center. And in that center lies the true magic of 11, where the spiritual and the material realms meet, dance, and become one. It's a space where revelations occur, where the known blends with the unknown, and where the seeker finds not just answers, but also more profound, more intricate questions. Master number 11 doesn't only beckon with a spiritual pull, it also plays a pivotal role in personal development. Every individual with the life path number 11 possesses an innate intuition and an ability to understand and empathize, making them excellent mediators, therapists, or spiritual leaders. With its duality, this number signifies a balance between dreams and reality. If one leans too much into the ethereal, one might lose touch with the tangible world, leading to anxiety or overthinking. On the other hand, swaying too much towards the material can hinder spiritual growth. The journey of self-awareness for those touched by 11 is layered. Many encounter numerous challenges, often internal, as they grapple with the vibrations of this powerful number. Yet these very challenges mold them, refining their spirit and character. By understanding and embracing the number's energy, they can unlock an enhanced ability for manifestation. Once aligned with the universe's frequency, their dreams, ambitions, and desires can be realized with remarkable fluidity. Understanding is just the beginning. Harnessing the power of master number 11 is where the real journey commences. Those under its influence should frequently engage in meditation and grounding exercises. Doing so creates a conduit for the divine energies, facilitating a smoother flow and reducing the bouts of restlessness or anxiety that might crop up. Visualization techniques and affirmations can also help tap into the number's potent energies. The duality of 11 means that its bearers often teeter between skepticism and belief. To harness its power, one must cultivate unwavering faith, not in any external entity but oneself. But this is only the beginning. Would you like to uncover more meaning in this number with a free personalized reading? Then listen up. I created the free Decode Your Destiny cheat sheet and a free personalized reading. Using them, you now have complete clarity on what lies ahead in your future. Click the link in the video description for free instant access. You'll also have uncovered profound insights into your life path, master, and angel numbers, deepening your self-understanding and opening the door to the spiritual wisdom that awaits you. Move with conviction in life by clicking the link below now.